What's up guys, and this is an instigating hardened pump action shotgun with bullets exploding for area damage. And, hold on, let me just take care of this super mutant real fast. <sighs> there. Alright, well now that he's dead, let's go ahead and take another look at this thing. So right now we got just a two star weapon with the explosive legendary effect and currently with that little bit of adrenaline we just gained and fully spec'd out we have 258 damage. Let's go ahead and look at some of the perks we have on this thing. Um, right now I have all the shotgunner perks also including shotgunner to make this or excuse me scatter shot to make this thing reload a little faster. Um, traveling pharmacy and we'll actually go ahead and put on didn't mean to do that demo expert and of course the three ranks of gunsmith um we'll chuck on covert operative for this one and we'll put on enforcer for the scorch beast fight there we go and then we'll put on bloody mess to buff our damage just a little bit and then we'll have right now exactly 300 damage interesting and I have the tactical paint from the camo bundle on because I thought it looked pretty cool So here we're at West Tech and it's currently nighttime right now. And we might want to get just a little bit up close and personal to these guys to deal some deal or good damage to them. And plus sneak attack criticals and uh You see my bats is a little terrible. 379 and I believe there's one more guy somewhere. Not in here. We'll reload real fast. Yep, there's another guy. He's dead. What about you? You're a doggo. I believe there's one more, maybe two more fellers up here. Yep. So there's the. And there's the part I was uh, worried about. Right there, I would sort of kill myself because of that, because I'd get too close to the things. Now we have full adrenaline and plus my stupid alcohol addiction, leaving us with 507 damage. That's pretty good for this shotgun, actually. But the part with the shotgun, you sort of have to be up close and personal to do the most damage, pretty much with all shotguns, because Bethesda broke them courtesy of Todd Howard and his developing team but um... yep there he is right there if he would come out and say hello hello Mr. Super Mutant, goodbye Mr. Super Mutant so okay now that they're dead we got some more, oh this little uh, baby right here Big scary missile launcher man. And one more. And right now he's dead. He's not going to be a menace to the wasteland anymore. And yep, that's everything outside, so it looks like we'll go inside. And we come inside for super mutant killing fun. Thirst one's dead. I think this. Ooh, he's a two star also. Come here, big guy, I guess. I was about to call him little guy. And it gives me some scrip. It's only gonna give me three scrip anyway, but that's okay, I guess. My perception now, since I changed up this character a whole lot, um, is really bad, so I just like the vats anyway. But we can get some nice hits like that one. And if they're far enough away, I can aim down without having worrying about crippling all my limbs and killing myself. Because when you stagger yourself, you automatically come out of stealth, which um, can be really bad, especially if you're trying to sneak around. Because without the suppressor, which kind of comes handy dandy, even though at the cost of range, um, I'd be dead. Oh, he has a missile launcher also, I believe. There we go. 
couple shots that I missed to take him out. Please don't come towards me. Alright. We should be okay. And... 947 caps because I sort of bought a few things. <laughs> uh, let's see who's back here. Why am I switching my shotgun? Hold on. Alright. That's a little, oh, nope, 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 nope. nope. Alright, well luckily this thing should be doing enough damage so I don't have to worry about these guys. Never mind. Um, thought I could get away with that. Huh. Um, yikes, we've entered a bit of a sticky situation, so now would be the time to run. And then come back in the hidden to kill more things. See, um, sometimes that'll happen if you're not wearing chameleon armor, which is on my other account, so, or character, it was what I really should have said, but, oh, two for one. Epic. And we'll go ahead and loot these guys up here to see what they had. Some caps, and some more caps, alright. Is this going to be a swing speed combat knife? Probably going to be a one star. Power attack, that's okay. The hunter's effect is terrible, but... I guess it's more script. Can't really complain. Although, I wish they would fix that thing where you'd get lower level um, weapon, like, not really lower level, but lower star weapons off of three star enemies. Most of the time I get fucking one stars, so, um. And speaking of, am I gonna get a three star armor piece? Oh, well, um, that would be good if it was unyielding. But guess what, it's not. And someone will still probably buy that, though. Yep, I see you. Let's let him back off a little bit so we don't kill ourselves. So is this the best uh, explosive shotgun or shotgun in general I've uh, or I've just reviewed? Probably not, but um, the best one I probably have is the vampires one. But this one's okay. Missed him. Um, don't know where he went. Will he come back? But as I was saying, the vampires one's pretty good. I have an anti-armor one I gotta play around with also that I got. So, I might do a little video on that one. Uh, let's see here. Where'd he go? I've seen him run away. You know what? Screw him. I know you're probably gonna be like, Well, you sort of forgot the super mutant that ran. I, I don't care. If he wants to run away, he can run away. He'll just have to be all alone because all his other friends are dead, so. Alright, we'll just quickly... Jam in this little computer. And there's a doggo over there. But guess what, we're not here for... I guess we are sort of here for the doggo, but... Kill it. I don't even know, but I'm kind of scared because we might die. If I could hit my... Yep, nope. screw vats. <laughs> I'm doing better without vats, and I thought that would help me. That's the thing that's... Look at these sights. I know you can't hear out this. The sights, the barrel sort of shrouds the sight, so... You just sort of have to look down and it's weird so that's what I mean by my accuracy even that I should be able to hit that
Alright, maybe it's not a good time to peek. Oh, shit. That was uh, way too close for comfort. And here we are about to die. I'm on my last super stim. And I think we can uh, all agree that I'm probably dead. Well, um, okay. Oh, boy, shit, I'm in caution. Never mind. Let's try and see with the uh, little. Well, I was in caution until, uh, I'm dead. I'm totally dead. Nope. I just needed to get away from that guy, like, right now. Because he was going to kill me. Alright, uh, I'm in a sticky situation. I'm out of Simpex. Um, but... Where'd you go? Alright, now that's all the safe ingredients. And fighting our way out of here with 491 damage. Yep, this is an interesting shotgun for those who want a shotgun like this, so I'd pick it up if I were you. Okay, so we're at the golf club to go kill some ghouls. Um, let's see. Seems I've found the perfect camping spot. Not they're about to flank me though. Um They might be about to flank me. If I see you cheeky. Yep, there he is. He was trying to flank me, but then I uh, was a little bit smarter than the ghoul. I guess that's not really much to brag about. What you drop me? Ah, uh, yes. Pop a new color quantum. All right, and now that we are no, oh, I thought it was behind me. Pretty good. That was a close call. <laughs> um, he missed us, luckily. There we go, he's dead. What'd you have on you, you stupid glowing one? Alright, but now that said everything here's I don't think we got everything here killed. Nope. One more. They're dead. And I think there's a couple more in the back. Kim, for example. Just, that was a pretty epic shot on him. And then... Let's kill him real fast. And before I leave, actually, let me just go murder this rad stag. Two for one again, so yep, that was the ghouls here at White Spring. 
So I just love killing. Oh wow. Well, I just love killing ghouls so much that I thought I might go kill some more. So, um, the ghouls want to pop out for me. There we go. And. There. Alright, well, still some more ghouls to go. But we are the ones that we should worry about. Alright, well, let me jump down there, please. Okay. And then again. Some more ghouls I should worry about down here. Alright, well that works. Let's kill all them real fast. Super mutants? Huh, I wonder where they came from. That actually injured me, by the way. Um, yes. Is this going to be an explosive handmade or a fire rate one? Uh huh. Well, that's script. <laughs> script right there. I guess if somebody really wants a handmade though, but. Seeing some okay three stars today. Alright, well, whatever. We just freaking ruined a lot of this. Oh, great. Alright, well there should be a few more. I'm sort of doing a breach and clear right now. Jesus. Um... Don't know what's happening to my screen right now, but uh. Where? Hmm. And that should be all the ghouls here at Charleston. Yeah, pretty good shotgun right here. Well, it looks like Swan's aggroed, and we're just gonna take a look at him real fast. If we can hit him in the head. 
turn around, please. Turn around. Not what I wanted to do, by the way. Um. And another look at the head, and he's dead. So yeah, that was... Yeah, they had some decent weapons on them. But yeah, that was the uh, shotgun uh, against Swanee Boy, which he's dead now, so... Well, time to make some crab cakes, am I right? Yep, there's gonna be some crabs here that are going to die, and they're gonna be feasted upon by me, I guess. Um... If you don't miss. And these things will absorb some of the damage because they're of course my alerts. They absorb damage if we hit them in the shell like so. Well thanks, you staggered me. Anyhow. We should be able to blast that Myerlurk right in the face. Um, forget about the glitches. Um, anyhow, um, yeah, because Mylurks have armor, you have to sort of hit them in their little, uh, soft spot like that. And they're pretty weak if you hit them there, so. And, looks like we're just gonna have to. Huh. Will we get the Mylurk Queen to spawn? Come on, I know you wanna come out. Fine. I might have a plasma. No. Fine. I might have a bloody auto grenade launcher that I'm going to review later in my. And speaking of water, might want to drink uh, before I do anything. There we go. And before she can do anything to me, let me pull out my shot. Um, hey. Somebody wants me dead, and yep, there she blows, and thank you for the crab meat. And so, um, yeah, those are the crabs here, and they're pretty easy to kill, so. Okay, the scorch tree should be coming out, um, anytime. Um, there she is. She's a nice, beautiful little, uh... Ins not instigating one, legendary one. Um, let's let me throw on Enforcer real fast so we can gain a cripple chance against this thing because hit it for six damage. There she comes on the ground. A little. A little too close for comfort, my friend. Well, she just is bombarding us. Jeez. Will she come on the ground for us again? No, she'll continue to bombard us even more. And speaking of friends. I don't... This is stupid. Please come on the ground, thank you. And yep, I'm under attack now. By things. And I'm also dead, pretty much. By said things. Wow, don't you just love that? Well, I mean, I was going to see what I got off the square trees. Had I not died to a stupid ghoul, but... Thank you. Alright, let's see what we got. And we got something that's not that great, but... Okay. 
So, yeah, the instigating explosive shotgun. Only really good at close range, but it does the trick if you want to get some good kills in. Um, basically, ammo capacity. I don't know why they don't buff the ammo capacity on longer barrels. That would be cool. Like, you could have an ammo capacity of, like, 10 or 12 or something. That would make a little more sense, but, you know, Bethesda. I'm... I honestly I like playing Fallout 76. I just don't like some of the aspects that are in this game. And um instigating explosive. Pretty good actually. Um let's see if I got it. Here it is. This is what I spent 5000 caps on. And it's also what I'm probably going to be reviewing next. It's a pretty potent shotgun, so well, if you guys enjoyed this, make sure you uh, like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next Fallout 76 video.